Hi, Eric Kuchka, Denturist and Managing Director at Barjet Denture and Implant Solutions. What we're going to be doing today is testing the relative fracture resistance of some dentures using this hammer. Even though this is not a scientific test, but it'll give us a good gauge and a good measure of where we stand. So what we're going to be doing is testing a few different types of dentures, uh, one being a cast mesh reinforced denture, uh, all ivocapped, um, a fiber force denture with ivocap, a regular ivocap denture, a press packed fiber force denture, and then just some regular traditional press packed dentures. The way we're going to make this as scientific as possible is I'm not actually going to take this hammer and start whacking away at the dentures. What we're actually going to do is I'm going to hold the, dent the hammer like this and let gravity take its place. That way I'll find it to be as relevant as possible. So now we're going to begin our testing with the non-reinforced press packed dentures. Looks like that one went in one shot. Two for two. Three for three. Good thing I don't gotta clean up. And next we have our SR IvoCap Precision Injected Denture. And we're gonna see how this mans up. Unfortunately, that one broke in one shot, too. Next, we're going to do a cast metal reinforced denture. This also has SR IvoCap Precision Injected Acrylic. And just to show you that we're not making this up, there is the cast metal frame. You can see it on this side here a little bit better. So this is not a gimmick. This is real live set. So let's see how this actually pans out here. Look at that. It shattered. Interesting. Let's see what happens when we hit it again. Cracked a little more. Now there's much more little cracks. Third time's a charm. And again, trying to apply as much of the same force as possible, letting gravity take the hammer. And it just continues to break. Next is the SR Ivo Cap Fiber Force Reinforced Denture. So just to show you that there's actually fiber force in there. Nothing. Somewhat of a crack. Like they say, third time's a charm. It's not completely in half yet. <laughs> now it is. So, having done these unscientific tests, what can we really draw from here? Because again, it's not scientific. Well, first of all, let's start with this pile of regular press pack dentures. If you notice in the video, right off the bat, one shot, they just fractured and displaced in the air. So we know that really it's not as strong as a cast mesh or a fiber force reinforced denture. Having said that, what conclusions can we draw from the cast mesh? Well, if you look at this, again, as I showed you in the video, it fractured like glass. As you heard in the video from the first hit, the cast mesh really just exploded. So what does that tell me? Well, which I didn't mention in the video and I'll tell you now, 
I put Mr. Bond on this cast mesh to basically be as fair as I could with the testing. Uh, and also, this is a very beefy framework. It's very thick. Uh, incorporated almost all the pallet and definitely all the ridge surfaces. Uh, but again, this just goes to show you that really acrylic doesn't bond that well to metal. Okay? What conclusions can we draw from the Ivo capped fiber force denture? Well, if you if you listen or you can go back and watch the video, you can actually see that the first hit that I had done, the, the noise was minute, it was almost muffled or you could call it a shock absorber. Uh, so that just kind of talks or shows me the give or the tensile strength, I believe is the proper term for that, that it had. And you know, it took about three hits until it actually cracked. So again, if you just look closely at this and we compare it to the cast mesh, it just went into two pieces and again, just shattered. The other thing I'd like to mention about the IvoCap Fiber Force Denture was extremely, extremely, extremely thin as compared to the cast mesh which had at least I'd say three or four millimeters of material, whereas the Ivo cap denture with fiber force was literally paper, paper thin. Just to compare again the thickness.